Hello and welcome to the Canadian Prairie Edible Garden. This is Randy and today we are planting our Mount Royal Plum. I ordered this plum from Mountain Edge Nursery, which is in British Columbia. And I've learned that the Mount Royal Plum is actually one of the best for Zone 3 and it's a self-pollinating uh, variant so join me as I set it in the ground and add more fruits to our uh, urban edible garden raining really hard not last night but the whole day yesterday and that made the ground really soft for digging which is really good
that's a hole. I made approximately twice the diameter of the size of the putt. And if you notice, there's beneath the topsoil is heavy clay. And I know this area used to be, I think, canola fields. So it was it was a dry agricultural land. And now we're trying to fertilize it, make it healthy again. mend it and make it more fertile.
here's our Mount Royal plum. It's the third plum in our garden, added to these two existing ones, which unfortunately suffered from replanting stress. This one is a Pembina plum. And both lost its most of its leaves after replanting. So I'm really hoping that they would survive the winter. The Pembina plum should pollinate with this Brookred plum. And if they survive the winter, I really hope so because they're not cheap. That would give us quite a number of plums. 